No hay. Llegó la teacher. Hello, guys. Give me just a minute, please. And we are going to start. <laughs> Empezamos. Es que yo así lo dejo. Hello guys, good afternoon, good to see you. Welcome back. Oh, I hope you had a great weekend, right? So, uh, how are you, uh, Jorge? How was your weekend? How was your weekend, Jorge? Okay. Okay, it was great, I guess. What about you, Josue? How was your weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo su fin de semana? How was your weekend, Josue? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, no problem. Uh, Josue, what about you, Gustavo? How was your uh, weekend, Gustavo? No está, Gustavo? Okay. So oh, what... está arreglando la máquina. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, what about you, Edenilson? How was your weekend? It was great. I it was, was... rest. Oh, you rest a lot. Yeah, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. So let's come back to the lesson, right? And uh, what did we study last time, eh, Ruth? What did we study last time? Do you remember? ¿Qué estudiamos? What did you learn last time? Hello, Ruth. Mm -hmm. Hello, Michelle. Hello, Ruth. Tell me, what did you learn last time? ¿Qué aprendió the last class or last time? Mm -hmm. About mm -hmm. for example, W eight questions, right? Um, mm -hmm. What else? ¿Qué más, Ruth? El no, present I... continuous, right? No, me está costando, teacher. Ok, ok, no problem, eh, Ruth. Eh, aprendimos el presente progresivo o continuous. Ok, so, ¿qué más aprendimos, Ruth? ¿Qué más aprendimos eh, la clase pasada? ¿Qué más? What else? Eh, Last year. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Las reglas también, ¿verdad? De Ruth. De los... How to say time, ¿verdad? Okay, también cómo decir la hora. Telling time. Muy bien. Yes. Eso fue básicamente lo que aprendimos about the WH questions, que me da un ejemplo de las WH questions, ¿cuáles vimos? Do you remember? ¿Cuáles fueron las WH what? questions? Uh -huh. Muy bien. What? what? Where? Where? What? Who? Who? Yeah. Uh -huh. What? Where? Who? Why? Why? Uh -huh. Who? Oh, who's, right? Who's, ese que la vamos a ver más adelante. Who's. Uh, and basically, okay, when, 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 okay, no. muy bien, muy bien, esas fueron las que vimos, y cómo which. formamos, which también, verdad, which, muy bien, which, muy bien, what about the present progressive, cómo formamos el presente progresivo o cuándo lo utilizamos, cuándo utilizamos, when do we use the present progressive, para actions que estamos haciendo en este momento, right? Ok, ¿y cómo lo formamos el present progressive? ¿Cómo lo formamos? Uh -huh. Utilizamos el subject, el sujeto, 
Le utilizamos el verbo. Verbo. Uh -huh. Más el verbo. Y, y ing. Ing, muy bien. Ing. Ok, muy bien. Y vimos algunas reglas también, ¿verdad? Cuando se duplican las consonantes, cuando se le quita la e, etc. Ok, thank you, Ruth, okay. for this review. And now we're going to have other topics. Ok, in today's lesson, guys, we're going to learn about more vocabulary activities and that obviously write more speaking activities. Vamos a hacer actividades de vocabulary and speaking activities. Hey, uh, let's talk about vacations, right? Let's talk about your vacations. What do you usually do on vacations, Gabriela? ¿Qué es lo que do you usually do on vacations? What do you do? Mm, go to the beach. Um, oh, you go to the beach? Mm -hmm. um, go to the mountain. Mm, yes, right, go to the beach. Okay, I uh, got mountain. Um, got to travel another country. Oh, travel to another country. Yes. Okay, that's great to another country. Okay, and uh, basically this is what uh, Gabriela does right in her vacations. What about uh, you? Let's see, Janira. Oh, I'm sorry, Janira. No sé si está en llamada, Janira. Oh, yes. Oh no, but I think she's busy. No. Okay. Oh no, mm -hmm. you're. Mm -hmm. What do you, you usually do on vacations? Uh, I go. I go to the beach. Okay. Another. Um, I go to the um park. ¿Cómo se dice oh, parque? you go to the park. Yes, go to mm -hmm, the park. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, it, Reunión, ¿cómo se dice? How do you say reunión? Reunión, meeting, okay. meeting. Mm -hmm. Ah, eh, go to the meeting, eh, family meeting. Oh, you, ah, you go and visit to have a family uh -huh, meeting. Uh -huh. right? Yes. Uh -huh. Family meeting. Ah, okay, that's great to stay with your family. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you, Yanira. Okay, so basically we're going to be talking about vacations. Some expressions, some vocabulary related to vacations. Okay, so let's continue and then we're gonna have a short reading. Can you help me? Let's see with the reading, Glenda. No sé si está Glenda. Vamos a, a discover, right? Vamos a discover what this place is about. No sé si está ahí Glenda. No? Okay, so can you help me? Uh, maybe Gustavo, I don't know if you can. Gustavo? Aquí estoy, Miss. Aquí estoy, Miss. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Glenda. I'm sorry. Okay. Can you please read the text, please, uh, okay. Glenda? Explore the unusual. Unusual. Mm -hmm. Unusual. Are you boring with the same vacation spot? Or world has so many beautiful places? Some of them are natural, like this cave in the Bahamas, and some, some of them. them um, man made, my name, name. like this cave in Turkey. Many people go to the same place every year. This year, we be, be adventures and play, play during the vacation at an unusual destination. Mm -hmm. Then spend the rest of your life enjoying the natural and man made wonders across our world so many places and so little time okay thank you glenda okay let's just repeat this word that is man made right uh mm -hmm. son los lo que hacen los la, el hombre right algo creado por el hombre man made okay mm -hmm. and we have the word unusual glenda, can you repeat please this one Hola, hola, Glenda. Sí, no, repítalo usted. Okay, it is man-made. Man-made. Yes, in unusual. Unusual. Unusual, okay, thank unusual. you. Okay, tenemos entonces la palabra man-made, que es algo hecho por el hombre, y tenemos unusual. So, uh, Eden Nilsson, would you like to go to this place? ¿Le gustaría ir a este lugar? Eden Nilsson, would you like to go to this place? Really not. Okay, why not? 
uh, I prefer some places near to to my country. Okay, which places uh, you would like to visit? Uh, for example, El Tunco Beach, the surf city. Yes, right. The Tunco, the Tunco Beach, right? Yes. Another yes. place? Uh, Alaska is a mm -hmm. nice place. It's a beautiful, uh, it has a beautiful view, right? Tiene una muy bonita vista y pan a wrong view. Mm. Okay, very good. Yes. What about uh, you, Gustavo? Would you like to visit this place? I'd like to visit uh, beach. The beach, yes. Yeah. We love the beach. I would like to visit, right? I would like to visit the beach. Okay. The mountain. The mountain, yes, right. The mountain. The forest can be, right? The forest too. Okay, what about you, uh, Jorge? What would you like to visit this place? Te gustaría visitar this place? Would you like to visit this place? I like. I would like to visit this place. This this place. Okay, why? Por qué este lugar? Why this place? Because uh, conocer teacher. Ah, to know. To know the other place and is, is interesting. Yes, right. To know other places, to know other places is interesting. Okay, there it is, interesting. Okay, so let's come back and let's see what we have for the vocabulary section. Okay, tenemos la palabra breathtaking, breathtaking. Tenemos la palabra secluded. Then we have the word getaway, unusual, vacation, spot, unknown, and vacation. ¿Cuáles palabras son las que ya conocemos? Which words do we know already, guys? ¿Cuáles palabras son las que ya conocemos? Which word? What about you, Alberto? ¿Cuáles son las palabras that you know? Uh, I know the... Relax. Okay, relax. Mm -hmm. we vacation. Have vacation. Mm -hmm. Unusual. Unusual. Muy bien. Unusual. Unknown. Unknown. Mm -hmm. Desconocido, right? Unknown. Mm -hmm. Okay, what about breathtaking? What's the significado of the breathtaking? Who knows the meaning of breathtaking? Ok, breathtaking, si lo buscamos en Google, significa algo impresionante, right? Something that it like is amazing. That is amazing, imponente también. That is breathtaking. What about get away? What is the meaning of get, get away? Podemos buscarlo en Google, guys, or in yourself, if you have it, so we can share the meaning. What is the meaning of get away? Escapar. Alejarse. Escapar o alejarse, yes, that's right. I would like to get away of my house, let's say. That is expression. That is a verb. Verbs. Es un verbo, yes. I would like to get away, to get away from my place. Algunos, por ejemplo, del país, ¿verdad? From my country. What about secluded? What is the meaning of secluded? Aislado. Aislado, yes. Something that it is so far. Algo que está muy alejado. Very far. Secluded places. What about spot? What is the meaning of spot? What, what could be the meaning of a spot? Tiene varios significados. Who has found the meaning of a spot? Mm -hmm. Spot tiene un significado. Lugar, lugar sitio, espacio. Exactly, spot. Like a place, right? Es lo mismo que like a place. Like a place. Okay, can you read the words? Can you read the words, Alberto? Can you read the words? Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Bread talking. Mm -hmm. Get away. Mm -hmm. Relax. 
secure it. Mm -hmm. I spot. Okay. And um, now. Okay. And um, usual. Okay. Vacation. And vacation. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Can you please read the words, Ivania? Breathtaking. Yes. Mm -hmm. Bre breathtaking. Mm -hmm. Get away. Mm -hmm. Get away. Relax. Secluded. Secluded. Uh, mm -hmm. Secluded. Spot. Mm -hmm. And now. Yes. Uh, no. Uh -huh. Unusual. Unusual. Mm -hmm. And vacation. And vacation. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Thank you, guys. So with these words, we are going to complete some exercise. No sé si tengamos dudas about our word. No questions? Okay. So let's move on to the next activity. Okay. Let's read this. Aquí ya vamos a ver las palabras en el contexto. And ya vamos a utilizarlas luego para completar this exercise. Can you help me? Let's see. Um, can you help me? Oh, let's see. Lorena, can you help me with the text, please? Hello, Lorena, can you help me with the text? Hello. Mm -hmm. uh, me. Oh, bueno, desde mm -hmm. ahí. Where do you like to go on the vacation? Do you love, do you like to go to a um, popular place or an um, unusual yeah. spot? Mm -hmm. Listen to these two people talk about their mm -hmm. favorite destination. Mm -hmm. My favorite spot is, oh, no, I, it, is it is difficult, right? Hotel Beach, Ocean let's say. Beach. Yeah, Cambodia. Uh, Cambodia. Uh, not many people know about this beach. If this, if this kid. Quiet? Uh, quiet. If mm -hmm. this quiet, um, I can relax, uh, relax uh, there. Mm -hmm. There are parts of the beach um, that are complete. Seclude. I don't like to go to um, tourism <laughs> destination. Mm -hmm. uh, so this beach is perfect for me. Mm -hmm. I like to tra uh, travel, pero yep. travel, no sé. To travel, muy bien. Mm -hmm. Travel to um, place. My favorite place to get um, a Get away. Get away is a Spencer. Glacier in Alaska is this foot. In this foot, we are very close to the glaciers. Uh, they are breaking. Muy bien, very good. Okay, just uh, let's review the pronunciation of the word relax, right? Relax. We have secluded. We have unusual. Todas. <laughs> no, 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 no. And then, son palabras nuevas, right? That's why. Tenemos la siguiente palabra, unknown, unknown, desconocido, unknown. Luego tenemos la palabra get away, alejarse. Get away. Then we have the word breathtaking, right? Breathtaking. Okay. okay, guys. Estuvo perfect, Lorena. Thank you. So now you're going to help me organizing the words with the meaning. Vamos a organizar las palabras de acuerdo to the sentence. Okay, can you help me, Eden Nielsen, with the first one? ¿Qué palabra, what word can we use with very beautiful? What word? ¿Qué palabra podemos utilizar with very beautiful? Um, about a place. Using the words, usando las palabras, the words. ¿Qué palabra? Oh, okay. mm -hmm. What word can we use? Tenemos very beautiful. ¿Qué, qué palabra podemos utilizar? Puede ser, por ejemplo, eh, relax. Podemos utilizar relax para decir que es beautiful. What word? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué palabra podemos utilizar? Puede ser 
breathtaking, ¿verdad? Breathtaking. Un lugar que es muy bonito, right? O muy mm. impresionante. Very beautiful. Thank you. Let's see, Gustavo, the second one. To be calm and not worried. What relax. Works? Relax, right? We can use relax. Yes. What about different? Algo que es different. Unusual. Unusual. Yes, unusual. And what about very private and quiet? Algo muy privado y tranquilo, right? Very private and quiet. What word can we use? Unknown. Mm -hmm. Unknown is como desconocido, algo que nobody knows, right? Secluded. Secluded, Secluded right? It is secluded. What about to go on a trip? ¿Qué palabra? Vacation. Yes, vacation. Right. we have vacation. Then we have a time when you don't go to work or to school. Oh. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué palabra? What word can we use? It can be like vacation, right? Too, or también vacation, get away. Oh, get away, get away, get get away. away. alejarse de algo, get away. Okay, what about uh, it says the meaning not many people know about it and not famous. What, what, what word it is? What? It is, I'm sorry, unknown. Uh, unknown, yes, unknown. Unknown, yes, algo desconocido, right? Something nobody knows. Okay, what about a place? Spot. Yes, right. Usualmente lo conocemos como place, but it is the same as spot. Okay, spot. What is your favorite spot, Gabriela? What is your favorite spot? To vacation, let's say. Do you have a favorite spot? Uh, yes. Uh, Which one? Oh, the, the beach. beach. Yes. From El Salvador or from another country? Mm, from El Salvador. Uh, from Costa El Salvador. Oh, Costa del Sol. Okay. Yes. It's your favorite. Okay, what about you, Alberto? What is your favorite spot? The mountain in the Chalatenango. Okay, yes, then the mountain. Mm -hmm. What is your favorite spot? Hello, Samuel. Uh. What is your favorite spot? Uh, I don't know. Uh -huh. A favorite spot? Mm. A favorite place? Un lugar favorito? And the, uh, the beach, playa? The beach, right? The beach. Okay, there you go. I don't know if you have questions about the words. No sé si tengamos dudas about the words. No? Okay. Let's move on, and I want you to complete this section in pairs, right? Vamos a completar this section in pairs. This one using the words that we have studied. Vamos a completar esta sección de acuerdo a las palabras that we have been using. Okay, these ones. Luego ustedes uh, complete this section y vamos a practicar, and you're going to present this part here in the class. And then, guys, you are going to discuss the following questions with your partners. Okay, idea número uno, vamos a completar esta sección with the words, right? With these ones. Luego vamos a practicar with your partner. Vamos a decidir who is going to be A or B and so on. And then we are going to talk about these questions. No sé si hay dudas about the activities, questions. No. Me puede repetir que era get away. Get away es alejarse. Get away. Ok. Ok. So, vamos a completar esto. Luego lo practicamos. Recordemos que esto lo vamos a presentar en la clase. And then, vamos a presentar this section too. Ok. Let's go to the breakout rooms. Y esta vez sí les comparto the activities in the, in the WhatsApp group, right? So, let's go there. And let me know if you have questions. See? 
Hello, Samuel, what happened? Oh, there he is. Let's see. Tradúzcame esa parte, Ivana. Spot, es como me gusta. ¿Estamos bien? ¿Estamos bien? ¿Estamos bien? Okay, ok, ok. I'll let you work, ladies. Thank you.
aquí, I like to go to Tinusual. O sea que el ir es muy inusual porque está muy, es una playa muy lejana. Esa era la cosa aquí. Hello, guys. Yeah. Questions. Do you have questions? Hola, teacher. Hola, una. Uh -huh. Do you have questions? Mm, no. I would, uh, let's see, in that one, just let me just check the words. Por ejemplo, getaway, mm, no sería en esa parte porque tenemos beach, right? Sería, ah, okay. sería let's see, my opinion, the fewer people, the better. Podemos utilizar, por ejemplo, unusual, unknown también. Podemos utilizar unknown beach. Puede ser unknown también. Or unusual. Uh -huh. O puede ser mejor también unknown porque casi nadie la conoce. Let's, I let you work. Tengamos dudas, questions. Es como que dijeron. No. Okay. Estamos bien entonces. I let you work, guys. Okay. Hello, ladies. Do you have questions? Tenemos preguntas, questions. Um, no, no, teacher. Okay. Did you practice the dialogue, eh, Guadalupe and Gabriela? Did you practice the dialogue? Yes, okay. I. You practice. Okay, perfect. I yes, let I you practice. Work. Perfect. I let you work, ladies. Hello, Rita and Carlos. Do you have questions? How is everything yes. going? Mm -hmm. Tell me. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, no problem. I hope you get better. Okay. Una duda, Miss, con yes, el sol, pero es esa parte de la plataforma. Veo que dice un examen. ¿Ese ya mm -hmm. se puede hacer o no? Se puede avanzar. Todo lo que podamos avanzar, it's good. Ah, no okay. problem. No problem. Podemos avanzar. Ah, ok. Ok. Uh -huh. okay. Uh, no sé si tengamos uh -huh. dudas. Any teníamos other question? Una, teníamos una duda. Uh -huh. Decirle, Carlos, en la que tenemos dudas. Ok. Estábamos 
uh, haciendo lo de la, la práctica, uh -huh. se lo voy a decir, Rita es A y yo soy B. Uh -huh. Un segundito, le voy a decir. <risa> If you want, I can share my screen and then you tell me. Sí. Ok, ahí está. Ok. Uh -huh. uh, R es letter A y Carlos es letter B. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh, hello, hi John, where are you? Where are you? Uh -huh. You were in class yesterday. Oh, I am so I am on the spot. Okay, uh, ahí, ahí sería I am on vacation right now. Estoy uh -huh. de vacaciones en este momento. I am on vacation. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, great. This is a play I know or is this in a uh, breaking place. En ese caso, como tenemos el an, en este caso como tenemos este an, podemos ah, utilizar ya sea la palabra unknown, right? ¿Es algún lugar desconocido? No, okay. Unknown. Uh -huh. O unusual. También podemos utilizar unusual, pero unknown es más cercano to the meaning. Ok, continue. The letter, the letter I like uh -huh. to go to unusual unknown. No, en ese caso tenemos me gusta ir a lugares inusuales. ¿Y qué palabra me indica in lugar, por ejemplo? Spot. Spot, right. Spot. Puede ser también places, pero como estamos utilizando el vocabulary to practice, vamos a utilizar spot. It is a secular dish, in my opinion. Yeah. And, uh, For people, the better. Mm -hmm. The sun is night. Yes, I am sitting on the beach right now. The view, the view of the beach is in Russia. Es, queremos decir que la vista es impresionante. So it's going to be? Breathtaking. Yes, right. Breathtaking. Mm -hmm. Okay. And... Um, It's uh, so beautiful. What a great way to get away. Perfect. Yes, get away. Mm -hmm. Yes, I can really relax. Mm -hmm. Yes. I really am really every day. In fact, I was sleeping before you called. Oh, I am sorry. So sorry. Have a, a great vacation. Thank yes. you. See you the next week. Okay. There you have. Perfect, guys. Okay. okay. So thank you. Let me know if you have another question. No, no questions, no. Rita? Okay. No, so remember no. that this part, you're going to present it in the class. Practice this and then discuss the next section. Okay. okay. I let you work, guys. You can call me if you need help. Canciones de la escuela. Hello, Lorena and Samuel. Do you have questions? Ah, pues todavía estamos ahí. Teacher, solo íbamos uh -huh. a agregar la, la, la palabrita, ¿verdad? Sí, vamos a agregar la palabra en esta sección y ustedes la iban a practicar. Por ejemplo, Lorena va a ser A o Samuel puede ser B o pueden cambiar. Oh. Okay, y eso lo vamos a presentar en la clase. En la clase. Después, así, como en, uh -huh. así como en la primera que dice, oh, I know vacation right now. Que ahorita estoy, que no, que estoy en de vacaciones ahora mismo. Sería correcto, vacation. On vacation. Oh, yes, uh -huh. I'm on vacation right now. Muy bien, uh -huh. esa es la respuesta. Okay, okay. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Esa sería la respuesta. And uh, no sé si necesitamos help with this part. No sé si necesitamos alguna duda. 
so I can help you guys. La duda es que si tenemos que agregar solo las palabras que hemos visto en... en... Sí, sí. solo las palabras, estas palabras que hemos visto, estas de acá. Oh. Vacation, unusual, okay. spot, esas. Oh. Oh. Ah, okay. es que esa okay. era la duda. Uh -huh. La o, oh. Lo otro es que no nos olvidemos uh, to discuss the following art right. Discutir esta sección también. Oh, okay. ok. Ok, I let you work. Okay. To work. Okay. Gracias. Ok. Lo demás prácticamente ya. Hello, Jorge and Josué. Uh, do you have questions or are we okay? It's okay. It's okay. Okay. Can you <laughs> tell me, for example, the questions? Did you finish the whole conversation? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So can you give me the answer? Eh, solo teníamos una duda. En la... En la... Mm -hmm. Donde dice, was a great way to... Ahí sería get away, ¿verdad? Ok. What a great to get away. ¿Qué sí. forma sí, más increíble ahora mismo de ah, alejarse, ah, right? Sí. From school and work. Ok. Solo esa era la duda. Ok, ok. Perfect. So, did you discuss this part? No, eso no le hemos... Es Todavía no. Ok, ok. No problem. El remember to practice this section, right? Because you're going to present it in the class. La vamos a presentar in the class, right? So decide who is going to be A or B and you practice. Okay. Okay, okay. thank you. Uh -huh. Hello, ladies. Tell me, did you finish? Uh, no. No yet. Okay. No okay. Yet. Do you have questions or are we okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you don't have questions, no problem. No problem. No problem. Como, okay. como, como. The conversation, did you finish the conversation? Ya la practicamos, the conversation. No, todavía no. Lo que pasa es que ahorita lo que estamos haciendo es la última pregunta de la segunda parte. Okay, okay. I let you work. 
estamos pensando que poner, eh, donde, donde nos pregunta si nos gustan los lugares aislados o los lugares populares. Que ¿Por qué nos gusta el aislado? Ok, ok. Ok, y solo, solo para ir solo cambiando algunas frases, podemos poner en la segunda donde dice Yanira, I agree because it is more, right? It is more. Ah, okay. okay. It is more relaxed. It is more relaxed, yes. I agree because it is... Ok, en la donde dice Ivania podemos cambiar donde dice I agree because... It has more space. It has, tiene más espacio, right? It has more space, okay? For my family and friends and me. Okay, there it is. Perfect, ladies. I let you finish.
Okay, guys, hope you finished. Remember, you're going to present the conversation and that uh, you're going to also to discuss the questions, right, that we have for the last part. So I'm going to start with, let's see if, um, let's start with Jorge and Josue. Are you there, guys, Jorge and Josue? Okay, no yet. So what about you, Lorena and Samuel? No está? No yet. Let's see, Carlos and de Rita, are you ready? Or with the conversation. Estamos listos with the conversation, Carlos and Rita? Yes. Okay, so let's present it, please. Hello? Hi. Okay, let's present Carlos and Rita, please, the conversation. Please, I understand because Rita is terminal. Mm -hmm. Sick. Sick. Okay, she is sick, so she won't be able to present. Okay, so uh, let's see. Vamos a ver si puede trabajar con alguien más usted, Carlos, para que pueda presentar the conversation. Let's see. <coughs> Guadalupe and Gabriela, are you ready? Guadalupe and Gabriela. With the conversation. No, teacher. Not yet? Okay. Vayamos. Eden Nilsson, Gustavo, and Ruth. What about you? Yes, we're ready. Yes, okay. Let's go and present the conversation. Gustavo, start, please. Hi. Yes. Okay. Hello. Espera, quiero poner mi pantalla. <laughs> <laughs> They come in. <laughs> okay. Hello. 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 <laughs> okay, estamos with the conversation, guys, con la conversation, the dialogue. Hello, guys. Hello. No lo copié, Gustavo. <laughs> okay. I don't, where are you? You uh, were my... in class yesterday? Oh, I am ah. relaxed right now. Yeah. Great is this place, is you know. Or is it a um, second place? Plus? Place. 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 I like to actual spot. It's a um, no, a no dish, in my opinion. The fewer people, the better. That's a uh, nice. Yes, I am. I'm sitting on the beach right now. The view of the ocean is breathtaking. Uh, it's, what, it is so beautiful. Uh, what I agree why to get get how from from Hand yes, I can really usual unusual uh, real unrest every day. In fact, I was asleep before you called. Oh, I am sorry. Have a good vacation. Thanks. See you next week. Okay, guys, we're going to stop here because of the time, but tomorrow get ready with the conversations and uh, because vamos a decidir quien lo hace the best, right? Vamos a decidir el mejor grupo. And uh, also, don't forget the conversation, the last part with the question. So tomorrow we're going to continue. I hope you have a great 
day and I hope to see you tomorrow, guys. See you. Bye. Bye-bye, guys. Bye -bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.